the analysis of horse motion from images developed by Edward Newbridge in 1886 is arguably the first application of imaging techniques to the study of animal motion. Since then, horses have been widely studied. They are big animals, but delicate, to the point that the accumulated loads from training and competition frequently result in unrecoverable injuries. We present Varenne, a very accurate and realistic equine network. Varenne is the first articulated 3D generative shape model that can generate highly realistic 3D horses. Our goal is to create a model that can support the development of model-based solutions for in-the-wild 3D shape and motion analysis. Compared with previous 3D parametric horse models, small and H-small, Varen has a much higher quality, with more natural proportions and body surface details. This is achieved with three key novelties. First, we use a much higher resolution model. Second, we train using real data. We use a novel setup to capture dynamic 3D scans of horses over time, capturing 50 horses performing dynamic motion. Varen is the first animal model that exploits a large dataset of real dynamic 3D scans to learn horse morphology and shape features, but also how bodies deform during motion. And third, we develop a novel, compact, muscle-based pose-dependent deformation model based on projecting 3D muscle models on the model surface. In addition, Varen has an anatomical skeleton where body joints are defined in correspondence of real articulation joints. We learn Varen in two stages. First, we learn an intrinsic shape deformation model from 3D scans, where horses are in a neutral pose. As in previous work, the shape model is a linear deformation model, parameterized by a shape variable beta that computes per vertex shifts from a template. Sampling the shape variable from this model, we can generate 3D horses with different morphologies, ranging from small ponies to large breeds. Note how our shape model can also generate head shapes that are typical of Andalusian or Arabic breeds. Once a shape is generated, the model can be articulated with linear blend skinning given the 3D pose parameter theta. In the second phase, we exploit the shape model to register the dynamic scans. This registration phase is mostly unsupervised. We register the model to the 3D scans, obtaining a dataset of about 3,600 scan and model pairs that we use to train the muscle model. Given data, the Varen network learns muscle-based pose-dependent deformations, such that the horse model accurately models the real data. The muscle-based deformation model adds a per-vertex shift to the intrinsic shape. The deformations are represented by a collection of per-muscle submodels, where each submodel computes the vertex shifts for the vertices that belong to the muscle. The muscle model is parametrized by 3D pose and the first two components of the shape variable. This formulation is compact, thus suitable for our high-resolution mm -hmm. horse model, and allows the analysis of the relationship between muscle deformation and body pose during articulated motion. With respect to a model without muscle-based deformations, here in purple, Varen, in blue, generates more realistic dynamic shapes. With its high quality, Varen bridges synthesis and analysis tasks as the generated model instances have unprecedented realism while being able to represent horses of different size and shape through a parametric generative model. The model and data are available